Hi there. My name is Zishan and I'm orthodox prosthetist by profession. And uh, thank you for watching this video. In this video, we will discuss about orthotics and prosthetic sciences. Uh, what is uh, we will get uh, you know we will go through more in depth about the profession. Uh, and for more knowledge about this speciality, we will recommend you to subscribe our channel for more videos. First of all, I will uh, tell you that orthotics prosthetics is an allied health profession and uh, it is an important member of multidisciplinary rehabilitation team other than physiotherapy, occupational therapy or uh, speech therapy and there, so on. And uh, according to the definition, there are two school of thoughts and uh, they have their own descriptions about the profession. For example, the Europeans, they believe that engineering, uh, it's an engineering profession and uh, Americans, they think that uh, it's a clinical type of profession, it's a medical profession. Uh, and Americans, they are uh, also supported by Canadian and Australian uh, school of thought that they also consider it a clinical profession. Uh, orthotics prosthetics has two specialities. Uh, for example, orthotics is a different speciality and prosthetics is another one. So uh, some countries, they have orthotics prosthetics in combined, but most of the countries, for example, America, Canada, Australia, they have either orthotics or prosthetics as a profession. Let us discuss about orthotic sciences. Uh, well, orthotic sciences deals with the designing, fabrication and fitting of different type of body parts. They, we call them orthoses. Uh, the main purpose behind these orthoses or body sports is to help weaken or fractured body part to recover or work properly. For example, in routine, uh, you can see the fractured braces, the ankle support, the knee support, the gauntlet and elbow support. There's so many um, over-the-counter braces are available now. And uh, let us just give a brief description of orthosis. It's an orthopedic device which we use to support, stabilize or reinforce the weakened body part. Uh, we use different materials in it like we are now we are using thermoplastics and then uh, thermosetting plastics uh, and previously we were using wood leather and metal for the fabrication uh, well as far as the professionals are concerned uh, the professional who is dealing the who is taking care of the orthotic sciences called orthotist and they are responsible to have a consultation and evaluation with patient and they prescribe them for the appropriate orthotic device that fits them well according to their affordability and activity level. Here you can see some uh, pictures of or splints or braces or orthoses. On the left, the green and the silver color, it's a frog splint. We use it for the mallet finger when uh, you know the uh, top of your finger becomes flexed due to the injury to your extensive tendon so it's helping us to you know reduce the pain and help the tendon to recover and uh, on the right of your uh, screen you find it's a brace like jacket it's a boost in brace we are using it for the uh, correction of uh, spinal deformities like you can see someone with uh, bowing of her, her or his backbone like moving dipping down on the right or left so we are using this to correct that deformities I hope that you understand uh, what orthotics orthotics is now we will little bit discuss about the prosthetics uh, in prosthetics, we deal with the designing, fabrication, and fitting of artificial limbs to replace the amputated or missing limb. Uh, well, the prosthesis is an orthopedic device which we use to replace the function and the shape of the missing limb. Like somebody can miss lose uh, his or her limb due to some diseases like 
diabetes, the gangrene or osteomyelitis and uh, or necrosis and then uh, somebody miss, can miss it due to accident, roadside traffic accidents or industrial accidents and the third person who may have missing limb they can it, it would be by birth so those people are fitted with artificial limbs to you know restore their normal life as much as possible again similar to orthotic sciences the prosthetist is a professional who is you know doing prosthesis and who is assessing patient prescribing him according to his requirement activity level affordability and uh, you know especially according to the latest trend we educate people we train them in walking we encourage them to come back to the normal life because uh, they most of them they are struggling from post-traumatic stress disorder so we are playing a um, you know very vital role in the rehabilitation of different people here in this video uh, in this picture you can see like uh, an amputee with below knee amputation is you now using the prosthesis and he's uh, climbing the chairs and we are now training him that how he can go back to his normal life and how he can use the prosthesis efficiently so these are some examples like how we can you know play a vital role uh, in the life of disabled by restoring their life back to normal okay now we will discuss that why we need or who needs orthotics and prosthetics devices so in this section we will see who needs the orthotic devices well as i discussed earlier that orthotics are very common in practice and almost all local medical clinics and centers are prescribing orthotic devices in form of braces or supports most of these braces or supports are ready-made and are available to different standard sizes for common problems for example the wrist strains elbow sleeves or knee sleeves and then ankle supports and the insoles foot insoles for you know flat feet uh, these are already made available and but the ideal thing is to get them uh, you know with the consultation of or an orthotist because uh, he's the one who knows the biomechanics the you know uh, complications of wrongly prescribed or sources or brace so it's better to consult him before taking any over-the-counter brace as well because uh, everybody doesn't does not have same you know problems same pathologies same um, level of uh, uh, level of injury so it's better for you to consult uh, a person in your area who is specialized in orthotics uh, you know it will be much better for you okay now let's move to the prosthetics uh, prosthetics as i discussed uh, in my dis uh, you know definition of prosthetics those people who undergone the amputations or miss their limb by birth or due to any ac uh, accident or trauma or in pakistan because of bomb blast and suicide attacks so these people they need artificial limbs even those people who are missing their limbs in the um, some machines they're working in the industry so they miss their hand or um due to you know injury from the machine so those people they really need the prosthetics to you know restore the normal life okay thank you so much for watching this video and hope you will find it helpful uh, please subscribe our channel by clicking the bell button or leave your feedback in comment section and if you need any further assistance please uh, email me on this num on email given in the end of this video so i will get back to you as soon as possible have a nice day and hopefully that you learn something new and you can now share with your friends you can support your disabled people 
and you can guide them appropriately where to go and where to get their uh, treatment done.